Hey everybody, I had a request to do a tutorial for Eric Church's Jack Daniels, and it's my pleasure to do that. Um, a couple things you should know, the chords are very basic. The chords are, back up for you here a little bit, D, G, A, B minor. Those are the chords, nice and easy. Um, I do this not like Eric does it, I do it like Jay does it. And it doesn't necessarily mean it's right, but part of when you're playing acoustical guitar is to sell the song, and you sell the song with rhythm and beats, and you get people to tap their foot to what you're doing. And a lot of that is the right hand. It's kind of selling the song and making it sound familiar. Uh, Eric Church has an entire band and a studio behind him. I don't. I just have an acoustic guitar, so I have to sell it just with a piece of wood and six strings. So. The right hand is extremely important here. Let me lower the camera a little bit. Okay, I do a little blues riff at the beginning of this, and Eric does none of this. Uh, this is just me to kind of help sell the song, and it's that kind of gets them going. Uh, that's nice and easy. A string, open A, third fret, A string, open D, third fret, third string D, open D. 3rd string A, open A, the D chord, so it's B, and I use that, I give it a little bend to give it a little character, you can give it, now the cell is right here, even though the chords are very basic, remember you want people to tap your foot to what you're doing, so you should practice this, you should mute strings, see if you can get a beat going. And when you get a beat going, people will begin to tap their foot. Now, you don't want to just beat right through the chord. It kind of sounds mumbled and jumbled, so you want to kind of mute strings. And to mute strings, you just take the D and you release the D, you release the D chord just off the fretboard. You don't take your hand completely off, you just kind of kill it. Just like you would string ring or you can kill it. This is, you have to learn how to kill stuff to, to create this beat. And you kill it with your left hand and you mute it with your right hand. So it kind of sounds like this. And hopefully they'll be tapping their foot to that. So after the intro, I'll play you through the chords again, D, G, A, B minor. Those are all the chords. I'm going to play two verses and a bridge for you. I'm going to send you on your way. Well, I've got a reputation Never been the kind of back down. I've thrown a punch or two, gave a few black eyes. But Jack Daniel kicked my ass again last night. Well, I hung in. But it don't fight fair like daddy told me to From every turn my head Then he snuck up from behind The jack that kicked my ass again last night Well I always thought this heart was made still and brew But the memory Once again, integral part of the song right here is your right hand and creating a rhythm, not only with this song, but with any song you do, you want to get them to tap their foot, folks. If you're just kind of strumming chords and playing songs that aren't recognizable to people, they won't get it. Uh, 
people are wanting to hear what they hear on the radio. So you have to closely replicate that if you can with an acoustic guitar. And that takes a lot. That takes a, that's a big sell. It's a lot of rhythm, a lot of chopping, a lot of whatever you're doing to get that song to sound as much like it does on the radio. There's your tutorial. I wish you a lot of luck with it. Let me know how it works for you. See you later.